Preparation of benzopinacolone from benzophenone. This reaction involves two steps. First step is the photoreduction of benzophenone to benzopinacol. This is the reaction here. Isopropyl alcohol acts as both solvent and reagent. Primary process is the excitation of benzophenone by absorption of light of appropriate wavelength around 350 nanometer generates free radicals. UV light is absorbed by the benzophenone and an intersystem crossing occurs to produce a diradical, a molecule with two unpaired electrons. After the diradical forms, it immediately becomes a scavenger, its oxygen atom quickly finding relatively easily removable hydrogen in the secondary position of plentiful solvent molecules. In this step, the diradical becomes a benzhydrol radical while the solvent molecule becomes a new radical. This newly formed radical is now highly reactive enabling it to offer a hydrogen atom to the oxygen of another benzophenone diradical, thus resulting in the formation of a stable molecule acetone as well as another benzhydrol radical. Eventually, one benzyl benzhydrol radical will collide with another leading to the formation of the stable product benzopinacol. Let's do the laboratory preparation of benzopinacol from benzophenone. For this, about 3 grams of benzophenone is allowed to dissolve in 5 ml of isopropyl alcohol with gentle warming. After all solid get completely dissolved, one or two drops of glacial acetic acid is added to prevent basic cleavage of the desired product. Then the bottle is filled with isopropyl alcohol up to the neck. A cork is inserted and the bottle is kept under sunlight to complete the reaction. After 4 to 5 days, white shining crystals of benzopinacol were separates out. Confirmatory test for benzophenone and benzophenacol. Here we are going to do 2,4 DNP test. Benzophenone, gi benzophenone gives positive test by showing orange red precipitation. Next, second step is the preparation of benzopinacolone from benzopinacol. In the second step, the benzopinacolone is formed by acid catalyzed dehydration of benzopinacol followed by rearrangement. The acid used here is hydriodic acid which is generated by the reaction of iodine crystals with glacial acetic acid. And this hydriodic acid reacts with benzopinacol followed by dehydration generates a tertiary carbocation. To attain a stability, the 1 to phenyl shift occurs and generates a secondary carbocation and which is get stabilized by forming a carbonyl group that is the stable benzopinacolone product. Let's do the laboratory preparation of benzopinacolone from benzopinacol. Reagents required are glacial acetic acid, iodine crystal and the conical flask, funnel, burette, reflex condenser and water bath are required for this synthesis. For this, take 1.5 grams of prepared benzopinacol in a conical flask. To this, add 25 ml of glacial acetic acid followed by single crystal of iodine. 
and the reaction mixture was reflexed for 10 minutes so that all crystals are get dissolved. The red solution is boiled for additional 5 to 10 minutes. And the reaction mixture is cooled to laboratory temperature and then kept it in ice bath. The benzopinacolone separates out. Filter the crystals and wash with cold water. Dried and weighed the compound to get a yield. So this is the benzopinacolone compound. Thank you.